one sweet ride. It's been worth the wait. We all know why we buy these bad boys. Because they're so fun to drive. My name is Matt. I'm what you might call a gearhead. I like anything that has to do with cars. And I work at BG Products. We made it. BG Products Proving Ground. This is the ideal environment for our master technicians to check chemistry and innovation. BG's Proven Ground completed two case studies evaluating two junkyard engines with similar mileage. The engines were pulled out of two 2015 2.3 liter Ford Mustangs with EcoBoost for testing. And both studies yielded terrific results that demonstrate how beneficial preventive maintenance really is. And that brings us to our next case study. BG wanted to do a similar test with a real-world vehicle to compare the results from the junkyard engines. So, they went out and bought a 2015 2.3 liter EcoBoost Ford Mustang with about 46,000 miles on it. The only thing they did to it was basic oil changes. Although all three engines are identical, this third engine has about half the miles on it as the first two junkyard engines. And while we're not expecting the same dramatic improvements on this vehicle, smaller changes can still translate into big savings for a typical consumer in both driving performance and fuel consumption. Let's get this case study rolling. This is Brett, our Proving Ground Engineering Manager. Can you give me an overview of the Proving Ground and exactly what we're going to do to the Mustang? Sure thing. The Proving Ground is made up of three separate teams. I'm over the engineering group where we design the tools, equipment, and adapters. We have a tech service team that answers all the service related questions. And here in the shop, this is where we do all the validation of everything BG Products makes. We're getting ready to put two BG services to the test to see if our products can return this Mustang to its OE levels of both performance and power. First off, we're going to test all fluids and check compression and emissions. We'll put the car on two dynos to see how the engine is performing. We'll look at the pistons, injectors, intake valves, blow-by, and fuel consumption. And then we'll do a deep clean with the BG Platinum Fuel System Service and the BG Engine Performance Service. After running the car on both dynos again, the Proving Ground team is going to test everything to see just how much improvement we can get from these two engine services. Ah, so you guys use science to check the chemistry, test it, retest it, and make sure that the products do exactly what they're supposed to? That's right, and I'm excited to see these results. We're here in the Mustang on BG's chassis dyno. We have Josh right here with us. Uh, he's one of the BG's master technicians, and he's gonna go through some horsepower and torque testing with us. What do we got going on today? Yes, yeah, so we got the car strapped down. Uh, it's on a Superflow all-wheel drive dyno. Uh, we'll take it, like any of our vehicles, take it in, put it on the dyno. Uh, we'll do three poles to get a baseline, and then, uh, then probably roll into some fuel consumption after that. Sounds good, man. Let's get this thing going. Yeah, let's fire it up. Yeah, now that we've got our baseline poles, we'll uh, we'll do our fuel consumption on the dyno as well to get a baseline for that, and then we'll actually pull this car back out, put it in the shop, and pull the motor out of it, so that way we can take it to the back and put it on our engine dyno. Can't wait, man. Yeah. We just finished the horsepower, torque, and fuel consumption testing on the Mustang. Josh gave me the keys. Now the fun part begins. Let's go take the engine out. What's going on, Brad? We had this thing on the dyno the other day and now you have the engine out. What are you doing? That's right, we had it on the chassis dyno and that measures the horsepower and torque to the wheels. But there's drivetrain loss in there that we'd like to take that out of the equation. And so we've got another dyno that we can hook this engine direct to and measure that same horsepower and torque and measure exactly what it makes. All right, so didn't you guys do this with two other motors too? That's right. So we got one of these, this same engine from a junkyard and after the BG services on it, we had amazing results. So we bought another one and did the same thing again and the same results. And so we got a car. We wanted to make sure that this wasn't a fluke, you know, of engines sitting around from the junkyard too long. And so we got this car and the same engine that we had the really good results 
and I'm ready to get this thing hooked up to the engine dyno. Are you ready? Right on, let's go. All right. We're all hooked up on the engine dyno. We have Josh, one of BG's master technicians, starting the testing. What's up, Josh? Hey, guys. So, Brad, what are we getting into today? Well, everything we're doing today is all about getting baseline measurements before we do any BG services to it. We use a bore scope to get a good look at piston tops and intake valves to check for carbon buildup. We also evaluate the fuel injectors under a microscope to inspect the injector holes for baked on deposits. We measure compression three times on each cylinder using two separate methods to ensure accuracy, an analog gauge and a picoscope. This should show us any irregularities in the cylinder. While on the dyno, we measure horsepower and torque, emissions with a five gas analyzer, and fuel consumption with the same AVL Plutron we used on the chassis dyno. Finally, with the injectors on the flow bench, we use a high-speed camera to capture the spray pattern and flow of each injector to evaluate consistency across all injectors. Well, look at the brain on Brad. So you're telling me that this testing shows just how dirty a 46,000 mile engine is with just basic surfaces? What's next? The Proving Ground team is gonna do two BG services. The BG Engine Performance Service uses EPR to restore compression, MOA to add heat protection, and 44K to clean the fuel system. And the BG Platinum Fuel System Service uses platinum air intake, valve, and combustion chamber cleaner to thoroughly clean and coat all internal engine surfaces. Then we repeat the same testing all over again and see where those numbers land. We're in the dyno control room now. We just finished the two BG services. What are we getting into next, Josh? Yeah, so right now we're in the middle of our uh, horsepower and torque pulls. Uh, so far, it looks like we're seeing a little bit of an increase in horsepower and torque. So after we do get all of this testing done, what's next? So we're gonna do another tank of fuel through this engine, uh, get our final fuel consumption numbers, and then we'll take it back off the dyno and put it back in the car. All right, man, let's go. Well, Brad, we got the engine reinstalled. The guys are putting the Mustang back on the chassis dyno. What kind of results do you think we're gonna get out of this? Well, what we're hoping for is a decrease in fuel consumption and emissions, and an increase in horsepower and torque. So why are we putting this back on the chassis dyno? Good question, Matt. Just because we got good results on the engine dyno doesn't guarantee that that power is going to make it to the wheels. So we strap it down here to validate those results. We're completely done with the testing on the Mustang. So Brad, can you tell us what you and the Proving Ground team learned on this particular engine? I'll tell you, Matt, we learned a lot about this 2.3 liter turbocharged engine, and it's great information for a lot of people to have. Looking at these specific results, we can see that the two preventive maintenance services we performed improved functionality across the board. For cranking compression and blow-by, the numbers show that the two higher mileage junkyard engines improved dramatically after the two BG services. The same can be said for horsepower and torque results. And while the improvements on the Mustang's engine weren't as dynamic as those of the junkyard engines, they still improved across the board. Our testing indicates that problems associated with vehicle maintenance neglect increases and accelerates with additional miles. So the more miles an engine racks up without good preventive maintenance, the more carbon buildup occurs on the engine. That's what the testing shows. But the most exciting part of this project has to do with fuel consumption. And it underscores that progression of issues that happen when we neglect our vehicles. After the two older engines received the two BG services, they averaged 21.3% restoration of fuel efficiency. That's huge. And of course we were wondering if the Mustang would fare as well. And? 11.2%. Whoa. Right? That's over 11% drop in fuel consumption in a vehicle with less than 46,000 miles. Now there's no way to quantify exactly how much you're gonna save but it should no doubt result in spending less at the pump. Well, Brad, I'm really not surprised by all the positive test results. It was great to see all the work you did on the Mustang, and now I know that it's gonna have more efficiency and power. It just goes to show that BG products and services really do what they say they're supposed to do. <laughs>